Tamerlanes too. The light is fading now, but still, Samarkand dazzles. Look at this, the mausoleum to Tamerlane, the great hero of the country that's now Uzbekistan. The buildings were extraordinarily impressive, but the tomb itself was closed, so I made an appointment to come back after dark. On entering the tomb, I looked up and was totally overawed by the incredible gilded ceiling. It was again the detail of the design that held the eye, and once again the colours dazzled. This was in contrast to the very simple and small tomb where the great Tamerlane is laid to rest. I headed back to the Registan after dark. Some of the lighting may have been a bit over the top, but it was brilliant to wander around the deserted main square, marvelling at the exquisite beauty and imagining the atmosphere of days gone by. Here the merchants would have bedded down for the night and calm would have descended on the square. Join me next time when I'll have one last chance to take in the splendours of Samarkand before making new friends on my way to the Nurata Mountains. <laughs>